So hey guys, this is a showcase of my Warzone Call of Duty Battle Royale <laughs> health system, whichever way you want to look at it. So you can see in the bottom corner that we can specify what name we've got, the colour of the name. We have three different armor satchel slots, whatever you want. And we have a health bar and then the cash that we've got. And on the right you can see how much armor you do have. You can run around the scene and you can specify objects that could be an armor or cash. You can specify which collectible is a value. So if you left click on the cash, you will add it to the amount of cash that you've got. And similarly, if you pick up the spinning armor, you will also get that and it will increment your slot. You can hold the F key or whatever you specify. And after a certain amount of seconds, which you can also specify, it will then replace the armor. What you can do is on this red over here is it will affect your armor because pretend this is gas or damage that you're taking. It will affect your armor before it affects your health. And you can see when I walk out of it, it's finished. And when I walk back in, we'll eventually end the armor and then we'll start affecting our health. But then when we leave it, you can see that then health will regenerate by a rate that we specify. And we can choose to then while it's regenerating, hold F and we can put the armor back on as you would expect from the game if you're aware of it. And once we've run out, we can't actually replace the armor anymore. So this was just a base to starting something so you can see this is just how it starts. And on the specific UI controller, you can specify the name, the color, how much cash you start off with, your current health value which can be up to 100 your maximum health bar so keep that 100 if your normal one's 100 so it's how long the the time awaits before it regenerates your health if regenerating health is just a boolean to say draw false so you can have that on at the start so you can regenerate health if you're not currently full when you begin and it's another boolean to see if you're in the damage area or not more debugging purposes but you can choose to hide them or not you can set the current armor value, which is a maximum of 300 because each player has a value of 100. Then we also specify how much armor the player has, the timer that it takes to equip the armor, and then the actual key that we can specify to actually equip it. Then just some of the UI elements that we can reference in the actual objects and the actual things themselves. And then on each of the pickups, we have a basic item controller which you can specify the value of each and specify what type they are. So similarly with that we can specify the value of the cash and the arm of the plate. So this uses two packs from the Unity Asset Store, the Sappy Body Plate and the cash and I'll leave links in the description so you can check those out. And be sure to check out my other awesome assets on the Unity Store, all the rest of my tutorials, check out my Patreon and the community Discord if there's interest you. So thanks very much for watching, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, cheers.